Well, I'd like to come back to this question of how AI might help us in the future. But even if it is a very speculative question whether AI will eventually outperform all intelligence on Earth, or it's very speculative whether or not we will lose control of it, I at least find it intuitively plausible that even if we don't know whether it's going to happen, the risk of how terrible it would be if it happened is so high that it's something that we should take very seriously. I think that we should take it very seriously, but we should not take it so seriously that we are doing harm. So if we are, uh, for instance, take the risks of the internet very seriously before the internet is invented, and we only look at the risks of the internet before the internet is deployed, and you have some very smart people anticipating the possibility that the internet is going to promote child pornography, copyright violations, misinformation, destabilization of political systems, right? All these things are possible and they all happen, right? They all are implemented on the internet. And yet they are a tiny fraction of what the internet is. And at the same time, the internet also is a tool to mitigate all these things, right? The internet is a tool to search uh, and uh, fight against child pornography. It is a tool to develop more ways to produce content, vastly more ways of doing that than uh, is destroyed by uh, harms to businesses due to copyright violations. Right? So uh, the urgency of protecting copyrights is uh, diminished because the tools to produce new content have become so much cheaper that we have so much more content creators right now and therefore far less danger to an existing industry that we need to protect at all costs and so on. Right? So basically the internet, if we were to implement safeguards to make sure that the internet is not going to do harm uh, would prevent the internet from existing in the, in the form that is manifesting all its benefits, that it gives argument to us, right? the ability to talk to everybody on the planet, the ability to find your people regardless of where you are, the ability to check up on news media and try to find out whether masks actually help or not by being able to find people who are really competent and discuss the best papers with them in real time as things develop, right? All these things are not evenly distributed, but they all exist on the internet and they're all real tangible benefits that would be prevented by, for instance, controlling social media and what you can discuss on social media by controlling every file that is uploaded, by limiting the file formats that can exist, by limiting the people who can actually exist internet and provide content to others and so on. Right? This would all be measures that would have to be implemented if you want to make the internet safe. And basically everything where people are currently looking at, ex pointing at existing AI models and say, oh, this should be mitigated, right? This is also stuff that where you can say this is applies to the existing internet. And this makes these arguments suspicious to me, right? There seem to be stakeholders that want to prevent competition, for instance. Uh, if you are uh, a professional prompt completer, if you're not creative, if you're not trying to prove new conjectures, then maybe the LLM is a competition to you. Mm -hmm. But maybe your job should be automated, right? And uh, I think that technology is not a tool to destroy jobs. It's never been. It's a tool to free people to do more meaningful things, more important things, right? And so, for instance, one thing that is currently not happening is we don't have enough people working in education. We don't have enough people who take care of uh, the uh, more and more older population, right? And we see this as an extremely big problem. But at the same time, we also think, oh my god, uh, AI is going to produce unemployment. And we don't have time to look after our grandparents anymore. How about we put this together? How about we uh, create exactly those jobs that should be done by people and leave those jobs that shouldn't be done by people to the machines? <laughs> <laughs>